Here we have a function d of t that shows a person's distance from home as a function of time. So you can see the graph. Let's take a minute and understand the graph. Our input quantity is time in minutes, and that's reflected by the labeling on the horizontal part of the graph. Our output quantity is distance from home in miles, and that's labeled with the variable d of t. And that's indicated here on the vertical axis. So if we get a feel for this graph, the person starts a certain number of miles from home, travels at a consistent rate of speed, and then ends up at home. And so the quantities on the input will tell us how long they traveled. The quantities on the output will tell us how far they were from home. So let's look at the remaining questions in this problem and try to understand them with the information presented in the graph. So the first one says to write a sentence explaining the meaning of the statement d of 15 equals 10. Well, input is, again, time, and output is miles from home. So this statement means that after 15 minutes, the person is 10 miles from home. And let's see where that is on the graph. So if input is 15, we go to the graph. Output is 10. That makes sense. That's an ordered pair of 15 comma 10, which we can also write just to be complete here. 15 comma 10 would be our ordered pair. Determine d of 0 and write a sentence explaining its meaning. So d of 0, well, when the input is 0, if we look at the graph, the output is 20. So let's see if we can understand the meaning behind that information. And the meaning is that after 0 minutes, the person is 20 miles from home. Another way to say that is that when they started out, they were 20 miles from home. The last one, for what value of t is d of t equal to 0? So here we're going to go over to the other side of the graph. This is the horizontal intercept. The information we found here, d of 0 equals 20, that is the vertical intercept of the graph. So if I want to indicate the time, that would be d of time of 30 equals 0, also equivalent to the ordered pair 30 comma 0. But if I want to write that as a sentence to interpret our meaning there, then that's going to be after 30 minutes, that's my input, the person is 0 miles from home, and there it is on our graph. Another way to say that that might be just a little bit more intuitive is that after 30 minutes, the person is home.